don't forget to check out my Patreon where you can get exclusive access to all my picks and all my trades before they hit the market and before they hit YouTube. So welcome back to the Finance Value Guy and in today's video I'm going to be talking about this project right here. Now you may have already heard about this project. This is a project that I did actually manage to look at early. Unfortunately the projects like these what actually happened was um, you know the way how they launched it was that you know they had so many people trying to minute, so many people trying to get to the stuff so that most people probably didn't get in. And now when we look at this project, okay, this is an NFT project. You can see the floor is at 6.4k on Ethereum. This is, you know, definitely pretty expensive, which most people can't really get into. So, um, yeah, as you guys can see right here, um, the Mechaverse um, project is, is definitely a decent one. You know, obviously the Mechas haven't been revealed yet, but in today's video, what I wanted to talk about was if you missed this project, okay, because this project did blow up very, very quickly. They joined in August, 2021. And as you guys can see, um, yeah, it, it's, it's been literally only, um, I don't, I don't know my months. It's only been like two months and, you know, already they have 200,000 followers, um, a big thriving community. So, um, yeah, cause I was, the reason how I noticed about this is that if you're over on designer Twitter, basically, you know, I used to design a very long time ago. If you follow free GCD others and stuff like that. Okay. Um, you know, they always working on interesting projects and stuff like that. And this was one that I managed to call early now. Basically, in this video, I'm going to be talking about this, okay? So, as you guys know, you might not know, okay, I don't really do many NFT videos, but I spend so many time on forums looking at NFTs and stuff like that. I thought, you know what, let me just make this video. Even if it gets like a thousand views and people don't pay attention to it, there's probably going to be someone that looks at it, looks into what I'm talking about, and maybe they're able to mint a new NFT drop, okay? So, this is a company, okay, that um, they do like next-gen collectibles, um, NFT drip, and just basically cool NFT projects that are really, really rare. So, when you go on their website, okay, um, what you're going to see, okay, is um, just wait for it to load. What you're gonna see is this. This is their next drop, okay? Now I'm not really gonna be interest, intrigued in this drop, okay? But um, just to show you um what kind of things they do have. If we go on the website, you're gonna see that you know the floor price of this stuff is literally ridiculous. Um, it's all you know punk based, punk based CGI stuff like that. Same for this one over here, and same for this thing over here. Some birds and stuff like that. So um yeah, definitely um if we load, as you guys can see, yep, yeah, birds and shoes. Okay, so now when I was looking at Twitter, I was like, okay, so far this looks like okay this project right here, okay by this artist. And you have to remember, NFTs are usually created by um, independent artists sometimes. So what we want to do, okay, is when we're looking for NFT projects and stuff like that, and this guy has actually just gained a bunch of followers after this tweet. I think this tweet is actually blowing up, but I'm actually catch this tweet, okay? And as you guys can see right here, this guy is making a new project, okay? Now, I'm not saying that this is going to be the next Mechaverse. I'm not saying that it's going to be something like that. But you have to understand, okay, that in the crypto and NFT space, okay, when we look at what projects there are out there, okay, we need to look at, uh, you know, the rarity scale. We need to look at things like... Like, you know, how common is that NFT? One thing I realized, okay, one, one reason why, um, you know, the Mechaverse blew up, okay, um, if I can actually go back to it, is because um, when you look, okay, and this is something that I know because, you know, I've done CGI before, I've done Photoshop before, just trust me, guys, I've done a lot of this stuff before, and um, this is why I like making this video because I can actually talk about this topic, is that this stuff, it, it it's it's a lot more detailed than creating a simple image, okay? So, for example, you know, think about your favorite um, NFT project, I don't know, CryptoPunks, for example, they're, they're, you know, they're, they're just one of the first, so that's probably not the best example, but something that recently blew up, um, you know, many of the ones that recently blew up, you know, provided that they're CGI, they definitely have, okay, a much, a much more intrigued because like, there's like, there's like so much more detail that goes into these ones. Um, whereas, you know, with some of the projects, um, you know, there's just literally so many different NFT projects. Let me just go on the soul network right now. For example, if you look at, you know, a lot of these NFTs, you know, it's, it's not hard to create, you know, cool beans or to create crypto clubs. It's guys, it's really not hard to create this stuff in Photoshop. Okay. Like, you know, um, cyber Fox, And I'm not saying that these, 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 um, you know, these prices are, unjustified i'm not saying that i'm just saying that you could literally go on fiverr and pay someone to make something like these um and all you'd need to do guys is within a couple of hours you could have your own project guys like trust me it's not hard to do this okay um when you're looking at nfts guys if if they're like the more 3d and the more detail it takes to create the more intriguing it's going to be and the more potential it has because i do believe that they're going to be more unique okay um and that's why you know stuff like crypto caveman club um definitely succeeds because you know it's not just an image that you can you know literally change within photoshop and and then just boom, you can get another one really quickly. But um, yeah, the Mechaverse, of course, is coming and stuff like that. But I think, okay, that this guy, okay, look what he said, okay, he said, yes, I'm working on something, can't say more than that. So we know, okay, that there's most likely going to be some kind of project, okay, which is very similar to the Mechaverse, okay. Now, let me look at this. Since this guy's working, um, you know, uh, this studios, RT, FKT Studios, I do believe um, this is probably what they're working on, okay? They're probably working on something because when you think about the Mechaverse, is there anything like the Mechaverse? No. When you look at, you know, um, the Soul Network, okay, you know, 
when we look at, um, you know, on the Solana network, you know, let's go on it right now. You guys can see that a lot of things are very similar, okay? You know, even Solana, RC, EB, Apes, you know, there's there's crypto apes. There's so many different apes, all these foxes. There's very different, like, these things aren't insanely unique, guys. You have to understand, there's only one real uh, 888 robot collection right now, okay? So, this is what I'm saying, okay? Me, personally, what I'm going to be looking for right now is, okay, I'm going to be looking if I can get into this project early. Because, yeah, this this does have 61,000 views. It does have 3,000 likes and stuff like that. It is starting to pop off. But it is nowhere near the size of Maker First, guys. And what do you think is going to happen if this project actually managed to drop, guys? If, if, if this drops and we have, like, um, you know... Um, and especially since um you know rkt labs they don't do as many items as before so the floor is going to be very very high so i'm going to see if potentially i can manage to get into this project um earlier i thought i was following this guy um yeah i'm on a different twitter account so um yeah as you guys can see um this one definitely looks promising these definitely look a lot more detailed and a lot more customizable and stuff like that um you know than the average one so i will be looking to see where this project is going to be going if it's going to be launched with um you know our rtfk and i just think okay that you know with these nft opportunities you have to look out before it starts to hype because by the time you're hearing about the hype um people are looking to sell it so um yeah in today's video i know it's not i know it's not something crazy okay and i know i don't really do videos on nft and i'm going to be doing videos on cryptos you know other other cryptos as well because i just thought you know what might, might as well okay but um yeah this is an nft project that um this guy you know is working on and i'm going to keep you guys updated because i just feel like um you know obviously there's nothing to buy right now this is pure speculation but i do believe that when this is drops early if you get an early you can definitely be like someone in the and in the mechaverse before all the hype comes around so with that being said um let me know if you guys are going to be looking at any 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 nft projects um i'm going to be continuing to look at some um there's literally so many out there the mechaverse obviously you know i'm not really buying in when the, when the floor is so high i'm not going to spend that much and um, when i can literally just you know buy a, a different crypto which is more liquid um definitely easy to get out of my position that way but yeah let me know what you think about the mechaverse and you think about other cryptos okay um and just from the patterns i've seen i think this is probably going to be very very successful so with that being said i'll see you in the next one and also, as you guys can see here, um, yeah, Coinbase is launching the ability, as you guys can see, it's trending. Um, Coinbase is launching the ability to, um, you know, launch its own NFT marketplace by the end of the year. So this is pretty insane because this is going to be a huge volume. Um, and if you don't know why this is insane, guys, is because seriously, anytime Coinbase la 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 launches, um, you know, a coin, usually that coin does anywhere from 50 to 7 percent. Um, you know, up to 300%. Look at what happened to Shiba Inu. Remember what happened to Dogecoin. Um, so yeah, it's definitely going to be insane because what's going to happen is, um, this is what I predict is going to happen, okay? We're going to have, you know, verified projects that are going to be on Coinbase and then we're going to have, um, you know, projects that aren't on Coinbase and when the projects go on Coinbase, the floor is probably going to go up. And I would, would say, you know, what is probably going to be even crazier is if, um, you know, Coinbase somehow manages to fractionalize um, NFTs, meaning that you could actually trade the value of them, which would be insane. Okay. So, um, yeah, I don't know if that's going to happen, but I think the fractionalized thing, um, basically what I mean, okay, for example, let's just take any random NFT projects. And this is just, I, I do think this will happen. This has already happened. I need to make a video about this, but, um, basically as you guys can see, the floor price is 14.9 F. I don't know how much that is in USD. Um, let's actually go and do the, um, calculation. Okay. So the floor price for this project is literally 51,000, okay? Now, the average person can't afford 51,000, so they can't get into this. So they do, okay? So let's say, um, you know, for example, and I'm just explaining this to you because I'm, you know, it, 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 it's going to make sense, okay? So let's say you have a project, okay, NFT project, okay? And this is 50K, okay, to enter, okay? People, they can't get in, okay? Because the floor is 50K. So if you don't have 50K, you can't buy in, okay? But here's what they do, okay? So let's say we have one piece of art, okay? Um, and that's 50K. What they'll do is they'll fractionalize it. So they'll slice it up like a pizza okay um and then each piece will be worth 1k and then people can actually buy those um and parts of it um just exactly how people buy parts of a bitcoin um and parts of other cryptos um because you know of course if bitcoin you could only ever buy one then it wouldn't have gone up as quickly because um you know there's not that increased volume of people trying to buy into it so i think this will happen at some time and point and it's gonna be very interesting to see what coinbase does so i would say keep an eye on this coinbase news because when it does happen um i'm guessing i'm pr that's probably where a lot of people are going to be buying their stuff from so with that being said um let me know what you guys see you in the next video.